So, Ajay Devgan slashed his way back into our screens with Action Jackson thanks to director Prabhu Deva. But does the film have punch? Let's find out. Hi guys, I'm Rahul. And I'm Nafisa Sharma. So tonight we actually watched a very interesting movie called Action Jackson. Oh no. Oh yes, that was my reaction too. So this is the story of a girl. Who is the villain? Falls in love with a guy. Who plays the hero. But his love interest is another girl. Who is Yami Gautam. Sonakshi Sinha, where is it? Didn't you watch the movie? Oh, right. Yes. But if you want to know that, then you should watch the movie Action Jackson. So in this movie, there is Macho Ajay Devgan. Sonakshi Sinha. Yami Gautam. Kunal Roy Kapoor. And the hot Manasvi Mangai. So Nafisa, tell us something about the performances. For me, Sonakshi Sinha was playing Sonakshi Sinha from Dabang and Dabang 2 and Rowdy Rathod and R. Rajkumar. Yeah. So Sonakshi Sinha. Oh, yeah. Ajay Devgan was actually the desi version of Uma Thurman in Kill Bill, Bruce Lee and a mixture of Singham and Himmatwala put together. And uh, also talking about Kunal Roy Kapoor, he did actually do a good job by playing a supporting role. Uh, he actually added that spice, you know, that humor in the movie. Also, uh, the villain, Manasvi Mamgai, she actually did a good job too. Music ki baat ki chai to I loved one song which is ta da ta ta da Oh my god, I love that song too. Actually, the music in the movie gave me a feel of the 90s. Are you because of the colors in the songs? And the Prabhu Deva move. Also because of the weird costumes that the actors are wearing. So Nafisa, tell me how the movie was. I think it's a khichdi of all Prabhu Deva movies. And if your idea of action is shoving knives into people's mouth or body, then go and watch the movie. I personally think it's a 70 rupee Thursday morning watch. Oh, 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 bah, bah, bah. But actually, I love the action sequences which are shot by Prabhu Deva. But the story, he's added a little unrealistic moments in the movie. And he's added a little flavor of the South Indian movies which he shoots. So on the hot slot machine, I give the movie... Uh... Two thumbs up. And I also give it a two thumbs up. So Rahul. Yes. Tell me three things that you learned from Action Jackson. Number one. You can totally stop a bus on the main road just to take support and tie your shoelace. Number two. Agar Ajay Devgan auto wale se poochhenge, bhaiya, andheri. He'll say yes. But agar mein auto wale ko poochhenge, bhaiya, andheri, but so late ho rahe, chalo. Hain. Number three. So if you're dreaming about your love and you want to see her right away, just look at the moon and it'll change to the picture of your love. Oh yes, it's possible. Don't forget guys, that we are not movie critics. We are just movie buffs. Hai. We love to watch movies and review them for you. Oh yes, so we are all from here now. We shall see you next week with another movie. So there you have it. That's our verdict on Action Jackson. But if you're looking to see a rock star in action, then look no further. We've got Shushmita Sen walking the ramp for designers Shivan and Naresh. After all these years, Shushmita still has it and owned the ramp. She wore a red bikini sari, which basically means that it's an Indian drape over a bikini. Not sure if we're really buying this concept, but she looked fantastic. And she was ever the style diva off the ramp too, making sure the cameras got her best angle, her long legs. But when it came to women appreciating their bodies, Shushmita had some very important words to say. And we show it to you with great respect. I think it's very elegant what I'm wearing. You can say yes, it's okay. But Shushmita was not the only showstopper. Aditi Rao Haidari walked the ramp for Nita Lula in a 50s inspired ensemble. The embroidery was stunning and perfectly in sync with Nita's theme of nude and gold. The zipper detailing and the sequin churidar were such cool quirks, but the best is yet to come. Those embellishments really are a piece of work. I really enjoyed wearing this. It's very light, it's very beautiful and I like, I like that it's vintage and uh, she has this Marilyn Monroe meets Madhubala concept which I think uh, is absolutely stunning and I'm so happy that she chose me for it because I love this kind of uh, style and this kind of dressing. But it was not just these two ladies enjoying some fashionable time. Jacqueline Fernandez attended the races and she did it in style.
In a Gucci dress, Jacqueline looked nothing less than gorgeous. She, of course, had the must-have headgear. One little question could those sitting behind her really see over her very large hat? Sharada did justice to her good girl image in this floral dress with the bow detailing. We just think she could have jazzed up the look with a messy braid or a stronger lip color. Huma had retro on her mind with her 50s inspired skirt and her hair in soft waves. Kajal was all covered up in a Shantanu and Nikhil look. We wonder what she was hiding. Well, you know, we don't have secrets. I'd love to sit and chat, but all that fashion's got me itching to go shopping. I'll see you guys next time. Until then, check out our website, 9xe.com, and our YouTube channel, 9xe The Show.